She's a freshman phenom with nearly 50,000 followers on Instagram, and she's got the game to back it up. Tonight, we introduce you to Union High School's Brooklyn Haywood. 50 points in a single game. And I was like, no way. As a freshman. It was crazy. She's got game. Once the ball is tipped, um, she's, she's kind of a killer. This is Brooklyn Haywood. She's definitely the most skilled girls basketball player I've, I've ever coached. At 14 years old, Haywood put the state of Washington on notice with a 50 point performance against LeConnor. It was a good team win and I didn't know I had scored that much. Closing out her freshman season at Union High School, averaging 26 points per game. How often are you on the court? <laughs> um, a lot. Ball is life. I make 500 shots a day. Before school, after school, then practice, Haywood is in the gym. She trains and practices uh, with one goal. She, she trains to be a pro. and. Uh, so I think that's kind of what sets her apart. Committed to her hoop dreams. My parents were like, okay, if this is what you really want to do, you have to kind of treat it as your job. And if you really want to be serious with this, like we'll make the sacrifices for you, but you're going to have to make some too. Haywood and her parents made the move from Anchorage, Alaska to Vancouver, Washington to play against more competition and be closer to her club coach and trainer, Matt Comboy. She grew up around Utah star Alyssa Peely and looks up to players like Paige Beckers and Kobe Bryant. They've also had to make sacrifices too, so it's like I kind of relate to that, making the sacrifice to move away from my family to come down here and pursue my dreams with basketball. She found a home at Union High School. Yeah, I felt really welcomed when I came here and like it's scary coming to a new school in a new state and stuff like that, but it I felt really comfortable around the girls here and coaches and just everyone here. She's also one of the most popular kids around. Haywood has nearly 50,000 followers on Instagram. My dad runs my social media. For me, I don't really pay attention to that stuff. I just kind of let my dad handle it. I don't pay attention to my followers and stuff. I don't really care. If, it's, if I'm being honest, I don't really care about that stuff. I just want to play basketball. Colleges have been calling her since middle school. Then came the scholarship offers. My jaw just dropped and like I went silent for like 10 seconds. <laughs> it was crazy. But college will have to wait. She's focused on finishing out her freshman year of high school and maintaining her 4.0 GPA. I couldn't believe I was talking to a 14 year old. Oh, no, I was going to say. All she wanted to do was talk about her teammates and everyone else around her who have helped her get to this point. Look out, another three years of basketball there at Union High School. Whew, that team is going to be It's going to be fun to follow her for oh, the next totally. few years. And straight A student there. And did you notice how she recruited dad to run things for her? <laughs> <laughs> Good job, dad. Parents did a great NBA. job. Yeah, yeah, I mean, how many kids do you know that are saying, forget that, I don't care about social media. I just want to play basketball. <laughs> you don't hear that very what often. What a talent. Mm -hmm. Well, Chris story. is here in for Matt.